you may not agree with this and that is your choice and I don't intend to offend anyone please believe me because like what do I benefit in trying to offend someone unless I am playing with them which I am not playing now I believe this lockdown to where people or many people have restrictions, which I believe they have restrictions or have to stay in their homes or something like that. I believe this lockdown is a blessing in disguise. Now, that may anger you, which I am not trying to anger you. I believe because of this lockdown, some people have lost their jobs some people may be going through financial difficulty. I understand that. Some people may be having a hard time with this lockdown. And you may ask me, why do you believe this lockdown is a blessing in disguise? I believe it is a blessing in disguise because some people may not know. Some people may know. But I believe we are primarily, or should I say foremost, I believe we are on this earth foremost to serve God. And I think some people or should I say many people, have placed their interest primarily on doing what they want. So, I feel God has allowed this lockdown to get people's attention. Now, this may seem very bad to you, but I think this lockdown is very, very light. I truly believe it is very, very light. So, as of now, I think many people can't say they did not have time to... How can I say that? As of now... I think many people can't say they don't have time to pray, read the Bible, fast, so on and so on. I think many people aren't working. So I believe God allowed this to get people to focus more or focus on their spiritual life concerning God. Okay. And I feel that this lockdown is not going to last forever. So I believe there is going to be a point of time to where I guess things get maybe not so much back to normal, but kind of back to the way to where you can go and do this and do that. If the lockdown ends, please, 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 don't go back and begin to do more evil if this applies to you. Don't go back and continue to do more evil because what I feel is going to happen something worse than this corony stuff which I call it corony this corony illness I believe something worse will happen so I think God is showing grace during this 
lockdown. You may be very bored. You may be very upset. You may not do as much. You may not be able to do as much evil as you like. If this lockdown ends, which I believe it will, if people go back and continue, if people go out after the lockdown and do more evil, let me tell you, I feel that God is going to, I believe he is going to allow or bring worse things to this world. I'm serious now. Especially in the United States of America. So give your life to God now. How many times have you ever witnessed something that happened to I think the whole world. Now that is to me, I guess. And if I'm and if I am correct about that, that is not usual. If you are doing evil, stop. You may be afraid of this coronavirus stuff. You may be afraid of it. But I believe things can get so much more worse. Please believe me. So give your life to God if you haven't. Whether this is end times middle times, beginning times. Give your life to God because do we know when we are going to die? And I believe we all have to die. So if we all have to die, whether it is end times or not, We have to live a certain way to get into heaven. We can't purposely choose to disobey God and believe that everything is going to be okay. So hurry up and give your life to God now while you still have the chance. Because I am telling you, and I believe too, when this lockdown is over, I think many people are going to go out and do more evil. And if that happens, I honestly believe something worse will happen. I think some people are very, very stubborn. So, I believe God will try to break that stubbornness with worse punishments. Yes, I believe this corona stuff is a punishment. I truly believe it. Now, people can say that it was because of this country or this tower or this frequency or whatever wherever whatever it came from I believe it is allowed by God so what is the use in pointing your finger over here or over there ultimately I believe it has been allowed because of people's sins so this country and that country is not really the problem. What is the problem is our sins, abortions, and stuff like that, I believe. So let me stop here. 
God bless you.